Scandinavian cities, what you have is something called a floor area ratio, which is called the FAR. FAR governs how tall or how much you can build on a certain plot. And if I look at Noida, we have an FAR of four on a commercial plot, which is basically you can build 4x the plot area. Okay. In Delhi, for a group housing, you have 3x when you're going for a redevelopment model or something like that. So you can build a 3x on the plot area. What in New York, in Manhattan specifically, you have is something called a road area ratio. And not a floor area ratio. They're actually governing how much you can build by the quantum of width you have on the road. Interesting. And there are, there are no boundary bonds if you see in Manhattan, you know, they're not gated complexes, they're all open coil texts there. It's a block by block here. Right, so if I'm actually going taller, I need to leave more space on the ground. A, for the road to get widened, B, for the public to move. Because I'm actually getting in so many people into the city or adding more people into the city. Okay. So it, there could be a concept wherein the boundary walls go get eliminated eventually, which cannot be done today. But if, it, if a new city is coming up, say a new Noida is coming up or whatever, we come up with this whole idea where the roads are widened as per the building height or the quantum of building that we're building on the plot. I think we could be in a better position.